<laughs> okay, so I totally just got out of bed, and I put on a binder just so I could show this, so, um, I'm not bothering to try and figure out how to shut the pool filter off, you guys can deal with the background noise. Um, double front compression vest, or, yeah, double front compression shirt, model 997 from Underworks, um, I usually wear an extra small, this is a medium, I just grabbed my girlfriend's, I'm not squeezing my happy ass into that tiny little thing this early in the morning. Um, always wear an undershirt. Always wear an undershirt. Um, if you're anything like me, <laughs> your nipples are gonna show through your through your binder anyway. So uh, wear an undershirt. It also helps hide where this stuff pokes its ass out on the sides here, and where this dips out in the front. And uh, it hot like if you're wearing a tight shirt, the seams will sh yeah. See, this is even showing through the undershirt. Okay, yeah. See, that's not an undershirt seam. It's a binder seam. So wear an undershirt. It makes it a lot more comfortable, too. Um, like, I usually get this roll of fat. And if I'm wearing a regular shirt, the shirt, like, gets... The, the binder hugs the roll of fat, and the shirt gets tucked into it, and it looks really weird. So wear an undershirt. Um, if you want to wear them down and out, I would just kind of push. Like, punch forward and push. Straighten yourself back up. You're going to get a chest that looks like this, which is still flat. If you want to look more like a guy, you gotta pull it out slightly like that. It's easy to do, like, if you just lay on the back, back of your bed and grab skin that's just, like, right here. Like, above and slightly out to the side of them, and just kind of pull them up and out a little bit. And you're gonna get a slightly more manly looking chest. It's, uh, finders too big. Um... Usually what I'm doing is, if I'm stealing her binder, I wear them up and out slightly, and then I make sure that the armholes are high. If I'm wearing mine, I'm pulling- I can pull mine all the way down over to the bottom of my ass, and it doesn't roll up from that point, and it helps slide my ass out. So I tend to wear mine pulled way down, which means the armholes on mine are, like, way down here, so if I pull mine up and out, they're gonna fucking hang out my armpits. So I push them down and out when I'm wearing it like that, so it does depend on how you're wearing binder. Um, just for the love of God, don't push them together in the middle. Uh, don't. It's gonna look like you have a giant mono tit. Not cool. Not cool at all. But that's how a lot of guys get that barrel chested effect, is if they just put it on and leave them there in the middle, then you end up with this, like, tube of extra mass on your chest, and that's just not, not awesome. Um, but yeah, either push them up and out, if you're wearing your binder normally, or if you're pulling your binder way down over your ass, push them down and out. Um, yeah, I think that about covers it.